hello everyone welcome to the cloud network in this tutorial i am going to show you about the uh, myra database upgrading from 5.5 to 10.1 myra so that is that is a database so you can uh, install and configure or upgrade this one myra database in your centos or uh, hat linux or debian or ubuntu linux mint or fedora also any system you can use to upgrade your mana database and every step and command you can find below to my video in the descri description box and uh, <coughs> what is the mana database a famous that is actually my mysql community fork so about this one it's developed by oracle <coughs> on december 24 2015 the latest stable version has been released <coughs> so mana database 10.1.10 and the website you can see this is the website of mania database.org where you can find about these <coughs> documentation upgrade downloading everything in the website so in this tutorial i am going to show you how to upgrade the 5.5 to 10 latest version so while performing the update we need to know that maria database recommends the course of upgrading is going for each version so for example maria data 5.5 to 5.5 that is actually it is going like that upgrading 5.1 to 5.5 now 10.1 is came so while the backup or the dump uh, all the maria database database so first before upgrading we need to take a backup of database my database always performing upgrading taking the backup of the existing database very important so either you can create a dump database with a command such as the command to create a data, uh, database backup so you can use this command in your ubuntu fedora centos linux red hat linux and the table linux mint also to take a backup this one and then uh, alternative you can stop the my database services with the uh, system ctl stop mysql and then and a copy database directory separated folder like this it will be and this is a step three that you can copy the database separate in the separate folder like it will become in the same location leaf variable but it will be having the backup of mysql so in the screen you can see and then in a case of failure of grading you can use one of the copies to restore your database during the upgrading if you fail means something happens to our database so we can restore the backup file to your res, uh, old, old database so and the next one is to add the maria database repository so for that one uh, the packages are up to date first of all so step 4 is a command to update your uh, uh, like operating system first of all you need to update so you can use the four step command to in uh, linux mint centos fedora to upgrade first of all and this update you can use in ubuntu linux mint debian and then and then on the send red hat linux centers for 23 people uh, use step 6 to add the respiratory and then adding the following text in that one we need to open this maria database respiratory list after that giving the date time also and this you, that means you can copy and paste it here which uh, i'm showing you that means if you are using 32 bit you can use uh, instead of amd64 replace it with the x86-64 in that one amd64 or you are using fedora you can use fedora version in place of center 7 on the ubuntu people operating system run the following command and then we can add the key after that like that one a step seven eight nine for the people you can use on this one the architecture that you see on the screen you can use 32 bit people i360 you can use 64 bit people amd 64 use and so important do not forget to replace ubuntu valley with your distribution name and release that is important now i'm going to show you in the fedora uh, workstation 23 how to do that one so here my using fedora workstation first i'm going to type the taking the backup of mysql and uh, i think in my system i don't have been installed the mysql uh, for their convenience i'm showing you how to take a backup and you can use sudo also before the mysql and then typing the password p s s w r d password hyphen use a l all and then 
like I have been type the command full press and enter so that means I have been not install the mysql in my system don't have a mysql here command or this is one more command you can use sudo system ctl then you need to give stop mysql press and enter typing the password here confirm now i am taking the copy of the or backup so you can use this command permission dynamics you just use the sudo here press and enter so I have been already so this is the copy have been completed now I am updating just type yum use update press and enter before going to so you need to be just perform the sudo here So now on the, on the screen you can see it's updating while using the sudo here so we need to wait some more time to, to complete the update here now adding the uh, respiratory here using sudo jdmh and then using your so command slash etc slash m then use respo dot d now just press and enter here typing the password here to continue and uh, you can see the configuration open now we need to just add the files here now i'm going to save this file just close this and save this one and then you need to have a now removing the maria database 5.5 previously version if you have means you can remove by step 10 is the command to remove and step 11 is the command to use in ubuntu to remove the mara database then we need to clean the respiratory cache step 2 will to clean the cache all those things and then step 13 to use the on ubuntu and step 4 for then installing mara database 10.1 and then we comes to on now yum hyphen install mara database server mara database hyphen client that used to be on the dot linux 7 centos fedora people can use step 14 on the dot 15 to use on ubuntu and net linux min debian and once it's completed you can start the mara database by typing the steps system the command on the both fedora and ubuntu then automatically start up after the boot up means just use the step 17 on the uh, operating system CTL enable mana data it will be automatically boot up when you reboot the system finally upgrade command is to upgrade the mana database then 918 is to command on work on fedora and ubuntu you can use on both this operating system to upgrade the mana database after to verify the after successful upgrade use this command mysql have fun with that will show the version of the that one now let us begin now now on the screen i'm going to press now enter after typing this command it will be erasing see on the screen so just confirm the yes here like you can see on the screen it's uninstalling erasing the verifying the previous version it's completed now now we need to clean the all the respiratory after uninstalling just type this command and press and enter after that now i'm going to install in the latest version of maria database up type this command and press and enter now just we need to start the minor database just type the command and press and enter so now you can see on the screen it's not been so please remember uh, in my fedora system I don't have installed the Maria database that's why I'm getting this error but if you have Maria database installation version 5 means you can 
upgrade this one by tapping this one command so not to worry about that one but it will definitely 100% this command works when you have a mana database just to for physically purpose I have shown you what is the command is working or not that is the why I have shown you so for any clarification you can comment below to my video like us and share my video on my friends and relatives help me spread my channel please subscribe to cloud Night channel and like us my page on the facebook also facebook.com slash network